Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to talk about something that is important for any crypto investor. How to safely store and secure your crypto assets. Now, before you start getting all nervous and anxious, don't worry. I am not going to bore you with a bunch of technical jargons. I am going to keep it simple, light and easy to understand. So whether you are a seasoned crypto pro or you are new to the game, you are going to want to stick around for this one. First things first, let's talk about why it's important. I mean, so important to keep your crypto assets safe and secure. I mean, it's not like you are going to just stuff your Bitcoin, your Ethereum or your Litecoin or whatever the token it is you are holding into a piggy bank, right? Crypto assets exist solely in the digital realm, which means they are all vulnerable to all sorts of digital bodies like hackers, scammers, and malwares. And if someone gets their hands on your crypto assets, well, let's just say it's going to be a bad day for you. So how do you keep your crypto assets safe? Well, the first thing you need is a good crypto wallet. Now, there are a ton of different types of crypto wallets out there, but the two main types are hot wallets and cold wallets. Hot wallets are the ones that are connected to the internet like a mobile wallet or a desktop wallet. They are convenient because you can access your crypto assets from anywhere, but they are also more vulnerable to hacking. Cold wallets, on the other hand, are offline wallets. They are more like hardware wallets. They are not connected to the internet as regularly as the hot wallets. Now, which makes them much more secure, but they are also a bit more inconvenient because you can't access your crypto assets anytime or anywhere. Now, I am not going to tell you which type of wallet is better because it depends on your personal needs. I will say this to you. You should never, ever, ever store your crypto assets on an exchange. Exchanges are great for buying and selling crypto, but they are not the safest place you want to store your crypto assets for long term. If the exchanges get hacked or goes out of business, you could lose everything you have. So always make sure to transfer your crypto asset to a personal wallet as soon as you can and as soon as you're done trading. Another important step in keeping your crypto assets safe is to use a strong, unique password and enable two-factor authentication. This cannot be overemphasized. And if you are using a cold wallet, make sure to write down your recovery phrase and store it in a safe place. And finally, always be on the lookout for phishing scams. These are bad actors who try to trick you into giving away your personal information or your private key. So be careful when you are clicking on those links and entering your personal information online. And always double check the website URL you are on to make sure that it is a legitimate one. So there you have it folks, the basics of keeping your crypto assets safe and secure. Remember, a good crypto wallet, a strong password, and being vigilant against scams are key to keeping your assets safe. And also remember, even if you take all these necessary precautions, crypto is a very volatile, risky asset class. So always make sure to only invest what you can afford to lose. Thanks for watching and don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more crypto related content. And as always, stay safe out there. See you on my next video.